Hello kiddos. Hope you are all doing good. I am happy to connect with you all through Disha Academy YouTube channel. You should all be eating your relishing food, wearing your stylish dress, reading your favorite books, enjoying your fascinating hobby and spending time with your family and friends. In this channel, I would like to discuss with you on mathematical problem solving and English language skills. As I am trying to share my learnings, I would like to thank my parents, teachers, friends and family to have shared their knowledge to me and given me a lovely life all through. Now kiddos, what is your favorite subject at school? I should rather ask, what is your favorite time at school and you would all unanimously say it is the time you play with your friends um, and the time you spend with your teachers and of course the time you eat lunch. Apart from these sweet times you have, don't you learn various skills to enhance your knowledge, work for yourself and to serve the society? How many of you like doing math at school? Yes? No? Isn't maths an interesting subject you all apply in your day-to-day -day life? So what is math all about? When you get up, you see the clock. You measure time. Your mom makes you a glass of drink. How much do you drink? About 8 tons of milk, which is 1 cup. This is a measurement and you are comparing two things. You go to the bus stand. You see two girls and two boys, which is 2 plus 3. Yeah, I have 4 of my friends standing at the bus stop. This is arithmetic. You discuss about a favorite serial you watched in the TV with two friends and they share this with two other friends. So the information is getting multiplied. These are arithmetic operations. You go to the school and sit in your classroom which is in the form of a square or maybe rectangle shape or some shape. You sit with your classmates at some distance. You maintain equidistance or it might not be equal distance. You are learning about shapes and relationships. This is geometry. It rains outside. You are not sure if your teacher will allow you to play outside or not for recess. You may go out 50% or may not go out 50%. This is probability. You go out to play with friends and collect different leaves, twigs and stones and arrange them to find how different leaves, twigs and stones are similar and different. You try to find out on an average how many of these objects you have all collected together. This is statistics. Today you have four friends playing together and collected 20 different leaves, twigs and stones. The thought of these make you very happy, right? Tomorrow you have two more friends joining you. So you try to find out how much more of objects you can collect. This is algebra. You try to ride your bike on a sloping road. You try to see how much of a slope is the road. You are measuring an angle. If you want to find out how much of a slant height it is? You use trigonometry. You go to the swimming pool and jump from a height. If you need to know the speed at a specific point in time, you are doing a mathematical calculation related to calculus. When you learn maths with a real-time application, isn't it very interesting and challenging? So kiddos, we'll connect, keep in touch with more of these videos. Wish you all the very best in whatever you do. 
enjoy your time and happy learning